show you how to unlock and get around any Mac that has a password or it's locked out to somebody's account. You can override it very easily. You hit the power button once it's off. As soon as you hear the bell, you hold down Command and S. And once the screen comes up black, you let go, let go of Command and S. And then once it comes up, it gives you the root option at the bottom. You're going to type in mount, M-O-U-N-T, space, negative symbol, U-W, space, forward slash. Then you want to hit enter or return. Then you want to type in rm space forward slash var forward slash db forward slash dot capital A apple capital S setup capital D done. And then you want to hit return. Now you want to type in shutdown, space, negative symbol, H, space, now. And all this will be in the description. Once you do that, it shuts down. Now you want to hit the power button. I'm going to show you two different things in here. You're going to go through setup going to set up a whole new account. This is going to be the new administrator account. Through this account, you can delete all the other accounts, or you could change the passwords, whatever you want to do. So now if there was an account that was locked out, you can go and open that account because you get to change the password to that account. You are now the administrator of the whole entire computer. Come up. Go through these steps like you would setting up any computer. Connect your Wi Fi. all that shit blank. Only thing you have to do is create a name. So I, I select that check mark. This video is for educational purposes only. These laptops that I have, I'm using them to educate you on how to do this. At the end of this video, they will all be destroyed. We recycle these things. Aaron, just wait a second. All right, now choose the line. Go to settings. Users and groups. You want to hit the, the lock because you want to unlock it. You could edit the password and get into the account if you choose to. We do not want to do that because that's not what we're making this video for. But you could do that very easily. You can hit the subtraction symbol and you can delete the account, delete the files, hit OK. Now if you look at the account it will say deleting, 
after a few minutes up to sometimes it takes up to 30 minutes but that file will get deleted and then you just go down the list you delete that one delete that one delete that one you can't delete the guest user and once you do that it's a clean laptop it's that simple it's what it looks like when it's done all the accounts will be deleted and it's your laptop now.